Hello YouTube, Black Lil ASMR Her. Um, I I'm just gonna keep this short. Uh, oh, and before I get started, I just want to let y'all know that I'm going to shave my beard and my mustache tomorrow. Uh, unfortunately, but there's a good reason. It's because I finally bought another motorcycle. And my helmet can't fit properly with all this hair, so I'm shaving it. Um, but it's okay. It's okay. I know some of y'all like it, but I need to shave it. But anyway, this video uh, is about an Oreo cookie necklace. I have it right here, but I'll show y'all shortly. Um, a few years ago, one of my friends from the Netherlands name is Trisha and if you're watching this Trisha thank you okay, but she told me about an Oreo cookie necklace I was like oh, I have to buy that so I totally forgot to buy it so a few days no was it last week I think <laughs> or maybe I think it was last or a week or a week and a half ago she reminded me she was like hey uh, did you buy that necklace I was like, oh, I totally forgot about that. So, um, I went online to buy it, but that particular seller, uh, there are two problems. Number one, that seller was in the Netherlands. Okay, so that would have been a long time waiting for that to arrive. The second issue is that that seller no longer sold Oreo cookie necklaces. <clears throat> so, Trisha, she sent me some other options so I found one that was located in America which is good for me since I live in America so I decided to buy it yeah and I was I was a little afraid because it you know I never bought it I bought it from Etsy too but uh, I'd only bought one other thing from Etsy years ago with some ASMR stickers that I put on my guitars <clears throat> So this is my second time using Etsy. So I bought these from Etsy and it took about a week to get her and I am very, very, very satisfied. So I'm gonna show y'all. Look at this. I hope y'all can see this. I can't see what's on the screen, but that's the front and the back looks exactly the same. Okay. Now I bought it from a store called BB's Faux Food. Okay. Yeah. And a lady named Eleanor. I think she made this out of uh, um, clay. And this is kind of heavy. It has a nice weight to it. Solid. And she has it double stuff. I thought it was going to be like regular stuff. But it's double stuff, which is cool. Which is cool. So that means the cream is more pronounced. But the dimensions are just perfect. It's like the actual size of an Oreo cookie. It has all the ridges. Okay, and it's Oreo in the middle and all those, I don't know, flower looking things that aren't really flowers. I don't know what those are. But this is just perfect. And <clears throat> she had a handwritten note in her. And on the front it says, thank you. I don't know if you can see that. So it's a handwritten note. I'll read it. So she says, Luke, thank you so much for your order. You are very much appreciated. I hope the Oreo is loved as much as I love making it. Eleanor. Yes. And Eleanor, you probably are never going to see this, but if you do see this, I do love this Oreo because Oreos are the sexiest cookies to have ever existed. Okay. Yes. Oh, it has a little like this little clasp thing. I don't know what it's called, but this thing. So, oh man, I always hate these. There. So I'm gonna put it on. Mm -hmm. Dang. I wish I had somebody with small hands that can like reach back her and put this on for me because it's 
difficult. Man, y'all, I'm sorry. This is really difficult. I have some fat fingers. I do. Okay. I'm going to get this. I'm determined. Come on. Come on. Okay. Try. Mm. No. I missed it. You know what? Screw it. That's how it's supposed to look. I was getting this the other day with no problem. I don't know what's going on. So, this thing, I would wear it right now, but I'm about to go and I need to wear a jacket. And this, it's not, it's kind of a tight fitting jacket, so I can't fit this under there. But I'm gonna show y'all this again because of how sexy it is. Eleanor, you are amazing. You, you just, I don't know. It's like one of the happiest things that has ever happened to me. But yeah. So I'm going to be wearing this thing with pride. So if y'all, you know, if y'all like this, she has other things too. She has like sushi little magnets. She makes magnets and keychains. Uh, like sushi and little, I don't know, little pieces of watermelon. It doesn't matter. She can make it. So BB's full food. Okay, so I need to go because I am about to go on an Oreo hunt. That's another thing, too. I went to, you know, like I said, I got a motorcycle um, Saturday. Right now it's Monday. So I bought the motorcycle Saturday. And Sunday, I was going to go on my Oreo hunt because I hadn't had one in a long time because I didn't have transportation. Since crashing my other bike in January 23rd. So I went to Sunday, I went to Target, uh, which is about 15 minutes away from here. And the garage was closed. I was like, why do they have the garage closed? So I went around so I could park in front, and the doors were locked, the lights were off. It was just closed. I was like, what's going on? So I went to another Target, which was about 10 minutes away from there. And they were close too. So I started panicking. I was like, oh, I'm on the Twilight Zone or something. What's going on? And I realized that it was, um, yesterday was uh, Easter. I didn't know Target was closed on Easter. Uh, somebody needs to get their exhaust fixed. But yeah. It was closed. Oh, why? I'm sorry, y'all. But anyway, I'm going today because it should be open. It's a beautiful day outside. I have maybe two hours of sunlight left. So I'm going to go on my Oreo hunt. Hopefully, I can find some new sexy Oreos that I've never tried before. And then I'll be able to make a video for y'all. All right, so I'll go now. Um, yeah, and if you've watched it this far, thank you for watching, okay? Goodbye, and as always, Godspeed on the Devil's Thunder.